Dirty scooter right there, boy. It's fast as fuck, boy. Oh, we're just taking some video in here. We're gathering some We're journalists. journalists. We already talked about security. We're journalists. We're just going to the public way access of lawyers. Call law enforcement. Call law enforcement. He's taking pictures. He's just having a panic attack. Excuse me, let me finish talking and then we can say whatever you like to say. The juvenile sitting in the lobby and this guy was taping, he was, his camera was pointing at these two juveniles that were sitting there. Listen y'all, these kids want to act up in school, want to go to school and embarrass you, want to make like they got no home training. So I told my son, don't go to school bathroom no more. I take care of you, son. I give you anything you want. I discipline you. But you're gonna bash me like this? No, so now I'm gonna cut his hair. Oh, I got to ask you. Hey. Hey, do me a favor. Just wait for the squad, guys. Now I so saw you were in a restricted area. Now I want your identity. You're not getting it. Don't embarrass me. I told him, don't embarrass me. No. Down here today at the Andrew Mil Myler's Juvenile Probation Department, we got some uh, extras. Unlike normal, we got Good Citizen News. We got News Now Ninja. Rogue Nation is already making his way into this building. I'm gonna get a few pictures of the outside here. Across the way, we got a juvenile court, I do believe it is. Uh, there's gonna be no smoking in this guy in this room, guys. So put out your cigarettes at home. We gotta go through the metal detector here. Oh, are, you, are you here to see some of them? Uh, no, we're just gonna get some pictures of the lobby. With. Oh, yeah, you have to go through the metal detector. We got wind in. Security scooter right there, boy. It's fast as fuck, boy.
I see a lot of education about to go down. I got this here sign here allowing us the public not to know that we're not supposed to be back there at the break room. Can we go upstairs here? It's an investigation, really. She's tricky. Yeah, yeah, boy, that's a nice one. Thank you. Here's the deal. No, we're good. You have a great day. Can I get your name, sir? Can I can I get your name? Can I can I get your name? Oh yeah, when I'm done. Oh. <laughs> can I get your name? Jeez, you almost ran my, almost ran me over, guys. And then try to act like it was your fault. I didn't walk in the end. It looks like you were cute. Sir, can I get your name? Excuse me, sir. Can Can I have your name? I mean, you, you given orders for us to leave. I think that uh, it'd be appropriate to at least tell us who you are here. Gino Birmingham, is that how you pronounce that? Gino Birmingham, I think it's on his name tag. Yeah. Gino. I got his name tag. He's like, you're not going upstairs. I mean, this is all the proof in the world that this is authorized <laughs> for us to be here. I mean, this reception's closed, but... That guy's triggered. <laughs> dude, it's because I went in that office. That lady in the green shirt and that big Hispanic dude in the blue shirt. Did you see him run me over? He just about ran me over down there. Do you want to freedom? Not <laughs> <laughs> much going on down here. Let's go check out this elevator. <clears throat> yeah, let's make sure they have their, uh... their signs on the car here. Yeah. 
there was, oh man. <laughs> it was like everything was going good. Then I go in that back room and all of a sudden it's like. Boom. Where that lady was? Dude, there was a guy and a girl in a dark room together. Oh. And they straight up were like. I'm not even recording. <laughs> they invited me in. They're like, come in. They wanted a three way, huh? <laughs> I don't know if this thing's working or what. Is it on or off? Might be off. I hear it. Yeah, it's coming up right now. We got the elevator tracker here. Back. It's a Briggs and Stratton 5.65 liter of tool, <laughs> tool engine. Like, with a, with a 3 8 cable. Beat the ground and listen for who's I, I, I don't think it's coming. Uh, there's a little bit of stuff up here, not a whole bunch. Not, not, information? Yeah, there's a little bit. There's some, there's some information art. on the walls. I don't think the, the think elevator's on. It must be a by appointment only. Well, I'm going to go check downstairs and see what the fucking elevator Because it, it, has to be, it has to be accessible for any case. What's the problem with going upstairs? I don't Anyways, know. I don't understand. Mr. Ball over there just wants to... Uh, yeah, yeah, different than this one. You got the trifold? It, it's okay to educate ourselves. If you want to look at it, let me know. Man. Let's get some more pictures of the outside here. We got a deputy coming. He's just having a panic attack. Excuse me, let me finish talking and then we can say whatever you like to say. The juvenile sitting in the lobby and this guy was taping, he was, his camera was pointing at these two juveniles that were sitting there. So I asked the juveniles to go sit in the back because they're getting ready to come out and they're going to record. By statute, they're not allowed to do that. When this video is uploaded to the internet, I'm going to prove that you just lied to the officers because there's not one juvenile captured in my video. Well, what he's talking about is juveniles come in here yeah, we both know that there's no expectation of privacy, privacy in public. public. Wow. Cats v. US, that's all you need to know. Which yep. have badge numbers? Huh? Which have badge numbers? Who am I talking Montoya to? You're talking and to all of us. Fox. Okay, so I, I, I want to talk to people. somebody that's in charge. Which one of you is in charge? Oh, we're all independent journalists. Yeah. Yeah, we're all okay, independent. Well, I want to talk to somebody by themselves. Talk I don't need four people. You can talk to start there. Oh, what do you need to know? We can start on the right and move over to the left. Why do you need to know my name and Because you arrived on scene. I need to know your name and badge number. I hear. Oh, right here. He's another right here and right there. What's your name? I can't read. I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm, I'm not a threat, ma'am. Fox and Fox. Okay. What's that? Dude, guys, I don't, guys, I don't care. If you, you can record all you want. I don't care if y'all record, do whatever you want. We're what not here to mean? argue with that. The, what we're just saying is here is hey guys, what's going on other than that. I think it. Do you have your ID? I don't need to provide it. Okay, Ben, you see mine. This, this is, what you, this is what you get. Let me see what you get. Why does your department issue with All we need to do is be left alone. Honestly, sir, to be completely, completely honest station. with you, I'll talk with you. What do you provide? My name is Ninja. I provided to okay? whoever We would have had one, maybe two minute. more minutes. We had literally gone through security with professional. Everybody was professional. Nobody had an issue. Until that guy came out of the back, got in my face, told me that I had to leave when I was taking pictures of pamphlets. Uh, I have one right here in my pocket. I don't have a problem with you guys coming here to do the videoing or whatever you're doing. You want, you want us out of here real quick? Go tell, go tell that man there's nothing illegal. in charge and tells you he doesn't want you on the property. I, I can't argue with that. This is a public property. It, it's, a public, it's public if you're here doing activities. I you have, do. I'm doing official business. But there's also some rules content. we got to follow, too. 
I'm gathering content. Well, you go in there and tell them it's not illegal this to film children, and it is we're out of here. For, to photograph uh, juveniles. Yes, sir, it, it is. No, it is yes. not. No. Why don't you come to one of my courtrooms when we have a trial? I can't go into courtrooms. Courtrooms? It's public, That's sir. Different. It's public. Public. They got law. They got a law for that. Then you're apparently wrong on the laws. Then for what reason can they have public. Public. for what reason can they have cameras in there and take pictures of the kids, but no one else can? I said you're a fucking idiot. Oh, okay. Are you obstructing the complaint process? If you want us out of here quick, all you gotta do is explain to him that we have the right as free press to take pictures in public. I never disagree with you on that. Listen, check this out. I'm gathering matters of public interest to disseminate to the public. That is the legal terminology, and I just told you exactly what I'm doing. I'm gathering I'm gathering matters of public interest interest to disseminate to the public. I'm not disagreeing with you on that aspect. What I'm telling you is on your aspect of it is what he is asking is he does not want you can't. He filed a false police report. He filed a false police report by saying I was filming the juveniles. I never filmed juveniles. I was filming the, the public information pamphlet area. You know the thing that spins with all the pamphlets? I was filming that, never filming people. I never even pointed my camera at people except for the public I never employees. said you did. I'm just saying that's what he's claiming. And so what I would like for you to do is just educate him that we can take pictures in there. Okay, we're but he's educating you on the fact that he doesn't want juveniles. So Y'all There's no juveniles. Come with me in there. Come on. Well, dude, let me they come you. in and out of here all the time. Here, I don't know you. who you're going to photograph. How did, they, how did the juvenile get here? No, the, they they the, had to come in here and report. How, yeah, but how did they get here? They walked in because the they front doors. Because they committed a crime? And now we're gonna we're gonna protect here? we're Why gonna protect their privacy in public. So what privacy in public should they have? They're criminals. So the the they lost that they lost that right to privacy when they committed a did crime and got themselves you, in here. Did you ask them if you could video you take them? Freedom? I don't have to. James Madison gave me the right. Well, we're just he wrote it on a piece of paper, and you guys gotta abide by that piece of paper. It's called the Constitution. Where does it say in the Constitution that you get to photograph juveniles? First Amendment, number one, law number one. Free press. Law number one. Like, okay. like, does, in Disney, do they ask permission for the 10,000 people in the background of the picture? No. What are you And that's even on about? private. I'm saying, who asked permission for freedom here? They just we can take here, pictures. Officer Fox, do you mind just... What is here, your speak with this guy, and he'll hand you a law that specifically states for what reason we're allowed to be in there. How about that? Correct. That's right. We have it all on paper. I don't, have, like a, I don't have an argument. Like I said, y'all can go into the courtrooms... And do your free press all yeah, you want there, cool. but the there are statutes. Are you giving permission to go in the courtroom? Taping juveniles. Really? What's the statute number? I'll look I, it up. You look it up. You guys are coming You're here. With, officer, you guys sir. are here with all the press and knowing all the information. I'm just telling you. No, we're just here taking pictures. <laughs> we didn't even call You're you the here. You're here in the, in the clown costumes enforcing so are, a law are, that you don't know. So are you going to arrest us if we walk back in there? No. no. Okay, cool. I'm going so, back in. I'm asking him to come back in to see if this is name. She won't give it to me so I can just get out of here. She'll, she'll contact him. She'll come she over to talk to him. She's saying she doesn't want to deal with people like me. I'm asking her. Well, you guys are the ones that are calling us names. And you call, guys. I didn't call you any names. You're with this group. I'm not this with group this group. Is, we were all independent. I, well, whatever. Y'all are the ones that are calling us and flipping us off and disrespecting us. I haven't whoa, done any of that to you guys. I think that nobody here started off with disrespect. I think you started it. Flip me off so we because you disrespected his rights. I haven't disrespected any of you all. You're telling us we I'm can't film children. Talking to you. Yeah. Yeah, just like that's using the color of law to violate our rights. We're not here to film children. Well, we don't want to film children. You're the press. You're a group. I'm just treating you all as one group. No. We're now we're all individuals. We've told you yeah, that's from like the very beginning we're officer, independent. We treat y'all like bad officers. All bad officers. Yeah, one bad officer makes you all I bad officers. Said a, I haven't said a thing derogatory, you gentlemen, at <laughs> all. They're all bad officers. I'm just coming out we, here telling we, you we, what we're going to do. Let's let them talk. What do you have to say to us? Are you going to go educate that guy? Or are you just going to I'll go talk to the guy. Please. Come on, let's go do that. Let's just jump to the chase. I'm tired of sitting around fucking pussyfooting with this guy. Let's just get to it. It's cooler in here anyway. They're here to speak with you, sir. You know what I don't understand is how somebody can commit a crime, become a criminal, come to a, have to come to a public place, and now we're going to protect their privacy in public. On top of it, their images with their charges, that that sort of thing, giving away the personal information. Right, right. Okay, because you can't tell me that if I'm sitting here on the sidewalk in a park and a kid runs in front of my camera, I can be arrested. <laughs> What this, what this gentleman over here doesn't understand is that I am with other people that are part of law enforcement and things of that nature. We completely understand law and we're 100% knowing exactly what we're doing. Like he said when we got here, we didn't come here to 
come and walk in this door with thousands of cameras not knowing what we were, thousands of dollars of cameras not knowing what we were doing. This he is our first rodeo. He doesn't care. You could have walked up respectfully, but now you're going to have to deal with the regrets, you know, that we have the right to regress our government. And this thousands of people are going to see your ignorance. So I hope you enjoy it. Because it might have to go back to people. Hey, hey. Times five. Yeah, they're creating some privacy over here. Come on, you guys are going to have to thank me later for all this fun we're having today at work. <laughs> Just think about how fun this is. You're going to have a story to tell your kids when you go home and your family. Guys, they're getting triggered in there again. They're getting triggered in there again. And he doesn't want you filming you if they're triggered in now. That's all he's trying to explain. Right, but anybody can stand out here. I could sit in my car right there with a dash cam sure and film every kid coming yes, in and out. Right, right. If you want to. But yeah, they're just saying inside the building, that's one of the rules they don't have. They, they, that's their rules. I don't one of the rules they do. don't have, exactly yeah, like you just said. One of the rules they don't. They you don't see, want they exercised their right to put those children into privacy. He said he moved them in the back room. Good. Yeah. He created privacy for the children. Well, it, it, What's it, the it, problem it, now? It, There's it, no it, problem. Because they, they got to come in and out of the building. But I'm saying, like, how did that child who committed a crime to get here in the first place allegedly or did something? committed a crime. All right, alleged, yeah, allegedly. If they're on probation, they've been convicted. <laughs> convicted or pretrial, been, yeah. maybe. I don't know how kids are pretrial. They're children's. How do these kids who got a charge on them, you're going you're gonna to protect their right to privacy in public and give them a right they don't even have? They lost that right. If they didn't want to get filmed coming in this office and look like an idiot, maybe they shouldn't have committed a crime. Now, one of the things that is, it is on us as, as independent journalists to redact that information and not disseminate on the Internet. So that's, if, again, yes. if, you, we can get pictures of juveniles. I could even get pictures of juveniles in the court. What I cannot do is publish a picture of a juvenile with their information. There you go. Like their crimes. That is illegal. That is ninety nine percent. I ain't even read the illegal, statute. Ninety nine percent I guarantee you that's what the statute says. Guarantee. Actually what I'll do is here. Because having an image I'll of a start child, this just camera an image so I'm filming that. Never be illegal. I'll stop this camera and illegal. let's look up the law together real quick. Right Let's look it up together. You guys can look it up out here. Let's now, you, you guys, I think you, that's why you're bringing the sergeant that here. That says he'd love to talk to you guys. He said he'd love to be educated. Laws against filming man. kids in Texas. That's why you're bringing your sergeant here. Is that what he says? I'm not sure if he's coming. I, yeah, I didn't want to. I just wanted the name. I don't know. Okay. See, that's weird because Google always just will go, 
the law is 30 blah blah blah. Okay, so do I have to identify in Texas? You see how she says something whenever it's an actual law, but she doesn't say shit when there's no law? Because there is no law about filming kids in public. I didn't say filming saying? kids in public. Well, why would you bring up filming kids is illegal when you know we're in public? I said it's illegal in courtrooms. Okay, but why, why would we even bring that up? We're, we're not, not even in a courthouse. Okay. Why is that? How is it relevant? This is also relevant? part of the court system. Okay, you just said that a minute ago, and you said no. It's on the other okay, building over there. But if they have a rule in here that says they don't want you doing that, I can't, right, well, they I can't have, have rules against you being ignorant. Yeah. Okay, well, it's that's, just so that's my game. rule. So you need to comply with my rules. I'm not gonna play your game. Oh. Come on, man. We're having fun. And you know what the pro you, you know what the problem comes down to with these probation officers is they're so used to being able to order somebody around and they have them do exactly what they want because they literally have control over violating probation or not you know they have that 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 ego to them and what happens is what happens is they they get somebody that doesn't and it just drives them crazy it's out of hand. I thought those police said they're coming in here. I don't understand what they're doing out there. They won't come in. I keep telling them to come in. They ask me to tell this guy to come out, but he's afraid of his. I think it's one of those blue line gang respect things where he doesn't want to come in here and make this guy look an idiot because we're right and he's wrong. Yeah. And uh, so he's not going to come in here and do that. They're hoping we just leave. Well, you know what my mama used to say, hope in one hand, poop in the other. That's, that's from grumpy old men. <laughs> <laughs> Is it? <laughs> The old man. <laughs> Gotta eat less bacon, Dad. Or I'm trying to fucking. Uh, it's disgusting, but instantly yeah. go to that. Instantly go to that. You remember back in the day, you'd show up with a camera and people would go, Hi, Mom! And they'd bunny ears people. What happened to that? Now it's scary. Yeah. That's the sergeant. It looked like he had some chevrons. Yep. He's the supervisor. If you want to see what's going on out there, guys, at this point, I'd suggest you go to Good News Citizen now because uh, he's over there talking to us firsthand up there. Ooh. We got a decorated guy here. He might save you. He might be able to pat you on the back and give you love and comfort you.
So do you have a body count? No, sir, I don't. May I believe it's no good? Cool. So. He looks cool. What's that? He came out being respectful. Oh, no, no, no. All the sheriffs in this county so far have been pretty respectful. Oh, that's thumbnails. I just got my thumbnail for shot. Here comes the shade of purple. Alright, is there anything I can do for you guys? No, no it's fine. Like, sure is, cool is there a call number for, for this call? It's going to be. Uh, no, there's not a call number. Oh, an incident number? Yeah, incident number. I'll get you one. I'll okay, get you I'll see. So we can do a public information request for the call to see if they lied on us or anything. Okay, I'll get you one. Give me a second. Okay. Oh, thank you. That's what I was just saying. I think you're going to sell a lot of sunglasses today. Uh, brother, it hurts Cinderella's feelings. He's walking in shame. Walk of shame. Walk of shame. Good job, guys. I didn't even take a picture of his name because he was so good. Yeah. Nothing but love from that guy. Nothing but love. Nothing but love for you, too. You, too, sweetheart. Good job on security here. Y'all yeah, did a great job. I got that number for y'all. Sweet. What was it? It's going to be five. Oh, I'm sorry. 255201. Thank you very much. And just put a 22, 22 dash in front of it for the year. 22 dash. Okay. Sweet. Awesome. Thank you okay. so much, brother. Sounds good. All right. What's your retirement date? Uh, not haven't, soon I enough, right? Put in, <laughs> in, 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 <laughs> that's getting close. Do you got the drop here? Like we can drop. It's like an extra five years and you get X amount of dollars. It's like a drop in the floor. Not really a drop, but the, the, the longer you stay, the more, the more you're uh, more interested in your retirement's going on. So it appreciates every year. It's tough, right? You're like, yeah. do I leave? Do I do one more year? Well, with, 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 with what's going on in the world, it's not, not an easy decision. Yeah, that's you right. Yeah, piece of plywood now is 45, 50 bucks. Jeez. That Uvalde police station probably making their jobs real hard right around here. Hey, appreciate y'all. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Appreciate, appreciate you guys. That's right. Yeah, just that, just like grouping one bad cameraman with all the cameramen, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, but listen, we want to make people shine because you know what? We need the police. There's rapists, there's murderers out there. Nobody is immune from the law, okay? And we love the law. That's how, why we know the law. That's why I'm not even recording no more. Because, because yeah, because we, because that, you know, well, we live by the law and we expect everybody little, else to. A little advice from you no, this sir. long time? I, I won't tell you how to do your job, you don't well, tell me how to uh, do No, mine. but I, I, I so want to hear what the man has to say. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Ruff him up. If you guys want to come talk to the police bro. or do yeah. stuff, yeah. we welcome it. <laughs> we don't have a problem with it. Anytime you guys want to. Oh, yeah, no, we'll stop by the sheriff's department. One thing is, is I'm not going to say who, what, and where. But it would be nice if we get a little more respect on some of the things. Well, now here's you know, here's the that's a give take. Well, right. That's you guys, you know, you guys all back that blue line brotherhood. But at the same time, how often do you the brotherhood say, "Hey, you guys are a little out of line here on this," you know? Yeah, yeah. And, let me let me say let me just say that, and and, and you're, I'm almost fifty, and I'm assuming that you're pretty up there in age as well because you got some gray. When we were growing up, how did they do it? What did they say? Respect is earned. Correct. Respect is earned. So I don't. I, just because you come to me but when with I a came badge, up to talk to you guys, hold on, hold on, I let me finish. You. No, I, not me. I mean, I, I hardly talk to you. I was inside, but let me just say that when you come to me, just because you have a badge and a gun doesn't mean you automatically get respect. So when you, I'll give you that. when you when you step, if you step correctly, then you get all the respect in the world. Okay. You but know what happens when you disrespect? Does it work the then same you, way around? Then you then you should get you know. I don't I don't want to say. See, I, I don't want to say. I know guys down there. You gotta keep professional. Hold you guys are paid to be professional. I don't want to say disrespect because in your position you're supposed to be professional. I'm sure you know the the case Houston versus Hill where the citizen has a little bit more of a right to challenge an officer and be verbally. I don't have a problem with y'all. Oh, okay, and the, re the reason why that is is because that's a hallmark of freedom. Because if we couldn't question the police, like if you guys were just to show up and you guys were like, oh, you got to do this and you got to do that, and we couldn't question that or, or verbally oppose that, that would be a police state. I agree with that. So that's why the court said that that even if, if, if we're a little rough, and, and I know some of our folks may be a little rough, but 
you're still supposed to be professional, even in the face of that. I agree. And, okay, perfect. Then, then we see eye to eye. We see eye to eye. That's fair. That's fair. We love to make you guys look good. We really do. Because oh, yeah. I'll tell you right now, everybody in this world, they want to love the police. Yep. But sometimes the police make that very hard. I don't disagree. There's, there are bad apples in There's the There's nobody in this absolutely. world that just yeah, wants, wants to hate the police. Know, we all want to be able to use your services. We, we all want to think we're safe. Well, it's safe. <laughs> but it, everything you guys say is give and take because we don't know until I'm talking to you guys what's going on. At the same either. time, from hey, my point topic, of view, sir, to, 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 um, to under, like, this one? throw the reason. Oh, you're going to love that. Pix Pro Codex 4K 360 camera. I know you guys are just friendly. Oh, it's 360? When you watch that video on YouTube, you go like this with your phone, you can turn around and look at him. Yeah, the only thing it doesn't see is right below it. You can look at his feet. Above it, but everything else you never grabbed a hold of nobody, you never got out of line, you never raised your voice and said nothing stupid. So on the internet, they're probably going to get on kind of battery mean to y'all while you're It has a... Uh, I know. Hey, I've been in the comment section for five years, trust me. In the comment section, they ripped me apart, too, when I fucked up. As a matter of fact, I'll give you guys cards here before we leave, too. I've been doing this a long time, too, guys. So I just trust me. I've been spit on. Whatever you I would never say. do that. Yeah, I mean, you, know, know, but, yeah. I mean, you don't find out how strong I mean, a piece a of steel is by just trusting it. You know what I'm saying? Just just the being a human. I believe in verbal talking with people instead That's of nice. the other I like stuff. That. Yeah, you were pretty cordial. I'll give you that. Very nice. So it takes just a regular. Either talk to me about 20 years ago or 30 years ago, I might have been a little oh, different. Yeah. Yeah. So I got extra ones no, and I got charges. Different times. So is that easier than running for that with us? I'll see you guys in the comment section. I'm out. Right, we live in a society now where people want to record how they discipline their child. The people that might get mad with this video is the people that probably already embarrassed their child. You can't you can discipline your child in their room. Take something away from them. If they act up, well, I'm like, son, you can't play the game.